Etymology The modern term, culture, is predicated on a term employed by the traditional Roman orator Cicero in his Tusculinae Disputationes, where he wrote of a cultivation of the soul or cultura animi, using an agricultural metaphor for the event of a philosophical soul, understood teleologically because the highest possible ideal for human development. Samuel Puffendorf took over this metaphor during a modern context, meaning something similar, but not assuming that philosophy was man's natural perfection. His use, which of the many writers after him, refers to all or any the ways during which citizenry overcome their original barbarism, and through artifice, become fully human. In 1986, philosopher Edward S. Casey wrote, the very word culture meant place tilled in Middle English, and therefore the same word goes back to Latin collier, to inhabit, care for, till, worship, and cultus, a cult, especially a spiritual one. To be cultural, to possess a culture, is to inhabit an area sufficiently intensive to cultivate it, to be liable for it, to reply thereto, to attend thereto caringly. Culture described by Richard Velkley, originally meant the cultivation of the soul or mind, acquires most of its later modern meaning within the writings of the 18th-century German thinkers, who were on various levels developing Rousseau's criticism of modern liberalism and enlightenment. Thus a contrast between culture and civilization is typically implied in these authors, even when not expressed intrinsically. In the words of anthropologist E.B. Tyler, it's that complex whole which incorporates knowledge, belief, art, morals, law, custom and the other capabilities and habits acquired by man as a member of society. Alternatively, during a contemporary variant, culture is defined as a social domain that emphasizes the practices, discourses and material expressions, which, over time, express the continuities and discontinuities of social meaning of a life held in common. The Cambridge English Dictionary states that culture is the way of life, especially the overall customs and beliefs, of a specific group of individuals at a specific time. Terror management theory posits that culture may be a series of activities and worldviews that provide humans with the idea for perceiving themselves as person s of worth within the planet of meaning, raising themselves above the merely physical aspects of existence, so as to deny the animal insignificance and death that Homo sapiens became conscious of once they acquired a bigger brain. The word is employed during a general sense because the evolved ability to categorize and represent experiences with symbols and to act imaginatively and creatively. This ability arose with the evolution of behavioral modernity in humans around 50,000 years ago and is usually thought to be unique to humans. However, another species have demonstrated similar, though much simpler, abilities for social learning. It's also want to denote the complex networks of practices and accumulated knowledge and concepts that are transmitted through social interaction and exist in specific human groups, or cultures, using the plural. Change main article, Culture Change The Beatles exemplified changing cultural dynamics, not only in music, but fashion and lifestyle. Over a half century after their emergence, they still have a worldwide cultural impact. It has been estimated from archaeological data that the human capacity for cumulative culture emerged somewhere between 500,000 to 170,000 years ago. Raymond Panikkar identified 29 ways during which cultural change are often caused, including growth, development, evolution, involution, renovation, reconception, reform, innovation, revivalism, revolution, mutation, progress, diffusion, osmosis, borrowing, eclecticism, syncretism, modernization, indigenization, and transformation. In this context, modernization might be viewed as adoption of Enlightenment-era beliefs and practices, like like science, rationalism, industry, commerce, democracy, and therefore the notion of progress. Rain Raud, building on the work of Umberto Eco, Pierre Bourdieu and Jeffrey C. Alexander, has proposed a model of cultural change supported claims and bids, which are judged by their cognitive adequacy and endorsed or not endorsed by the symbolic authority of the cultural community in question. A 19th-century engraving showing Australian natives opposing the arrival of Captain Cook in 1770 and a Syrian child wearing traditional clothing. Cultural invention has come to mean any innovation that's new and located to be useful to a gaggle of individuals and expressed in their behavior but which doesn't exist as an object. Humanity is during a global, accelerating culture change period, driven by the expansion of international commerce, the mass media, and in particular, the human population explosion, among other factors. 
Culture repositioning means the reconstruction of the cultural concept of a society. Full-length profile portrait of Turkmen woman, standing on a carpet at the doorway to a yurt, wearing traditional clothing and jewelry cultures are internally suffering from both forces encouraging change and forces resisting change. These forces are associated with both social structures and natural events, and are involved within the perpetuation of cultural ideas and practices within current structures, which themselves are subject to vary. C. Structuration. Social conflict and therefore the development of technologies can produce changes within a society by altering social dynamics and promoting new cultural models, and spurring or enabling generative action. These social shifts may accompany ideological shifts and other sorts of cultural change. For instance, the U.S. feminism involved new practices that produced a shift in gender relations, altering both gender and economic structures. Environmental conditions can also enter as factors. For instance, after tropical forests returned at the top of the last glacial period, plants suitable for domestication were available, resulting in the invention of agriculture, which successively caused many cultural innovations and shifts in social dynamics. Cultures are externally affected via contact between societies, which can also produce, or inhibit, social shifts and changes in cultural practices. War or competition over resources may impact technological development or social dynamics. Additionally, cultural ideas may transfer from one society to a different, through diffusion or acculturation. In diffusion, the shape of something, though not necessarily its meaning, moves from one culture to a different. For instance, Western restaurant chains and culinary brands sparked curiosity and fascination to the Chinese as China opened its economy to international trade the late 20th century. Stimulus diffusion, the sharing of ideas, refers to a component of one culture resulting in an invention or propagation in another. Direct borrowing, on the opposite hand, tends to ask technological or tangible diffusion from one culture to a different. Diffusion of innovations theory presents a research-based model of why and when individuals and cultures adopt new ideas, practices, and products. Acculturation has different meanings. Still, during this context, it refers to the replacement of traits of one culture with another, like what happened to certain Native American tribes and lots of indigenous peoples across the world during the method of colonization. Related processes on a private level include assimilation, adoption of a special culture by an individual, and transculturation. The transnational flow of culture has played a serious role in merging different cultures and sharing thoughts, ideas, and beliefs.